Hey guys, welcome to the latest episode of Z Code System here on YouTube. Drew coming at you, and today we're going to talk about the NHL playoffs, which dropped the puck just next week. So a very exciting time if you are an NHL better. And we've got some great NHL action coming up with the playoffs coming up <laughs> next week. So if you go to the website zcodesystem.com backslash blog and scroll down, you can see my preview there for the 2021-2022 Stanley Cup playoffs. And uh, we have the odds there, which we're going to go over here in the video very shortly. And we're also going to talk about, uh, well, the teams that have made the uh, NHL playoffs and the matchup so far. Uh, the season ends on Friday night, April 29th, uh, giving teams two days to relax and prepare for the playoffs starting on Monday, the 2nd of May. And... Uh, there is a little bit of jockeying I guess teams can be doing in the next two days, Thursday and Friday, uh, before the games are solidified or the series are solidified for the playoffs. All right, so of course, go over to zcodesystem.com backslash blog, read my blog there preview for the NHL, uh, the NHL Cup playoffs, Stanley Cup playoffs that is, and also be sure to check back in with the blog to get the latest picks when we post them throughout the NHL postseason. And of course, we'll be putting the videos for those picks up here on YouTube as well. And of course, you can find all kinds of other great information on the blog. Read up about how you can make great profits using Z Code System. And go over to zcodesystem.com and sign up today for the latest tools to use for betting on the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs. And if you are a better of other sports, such as uh, baseball, basketball, soccer. Well, we've got those tools over there too at Z Code System. So go there and enjoy those and get help making picks and investments on sports. All right, guys, let's take a look here at the odds, the futures odds to win the Stanley Cup playoffs coming up starting next week. Okay, so here are the NHL futures odds for the 2021-2022 Stanley Cup playoffs. And I'm using Bet365. That is my favorite online sports book. And uh, this is the one I'm showing you here. I use it a lot here in our videos for Z Code System. Of course, you can use your favorite sports book, your favorite online sports book to get your latest odds. Now, as you can see there, we've got the Colorado Avalanche at plus 350 to win the Stanley Cup. Florida Panthers plus 550. Uh, going to the Calgary Flames at plus 750. Uh, Toronto Maple Leafs plus 1,000. Carolina Hurricanes plus 1,000. Uh, Tampa Bay plus 1,100. Uh, 1, uh, and keep in mind, Tampa Bay have won the last two Stanley Cups um, as we head into this year's postseason. Now, one of the great things about this year's postseason is we're going to see the NHL playoffs get back to what we uh, what we most think of when we think of the NHL postseason. Uh, the last two NHL playoffs have been um, altered by COVID-19. Uh, in 2020, we saw that uh, the teams were in bubbles and they played uh, with no fans. And then last season, we saw the uh, divisions uh, changed into where we had the All Canadian Division, uh, which you know led to a bit of a, an easy uh, division there for those Canadian teams. And we saw the Montreal Canadiens getting all the way to the Stanley Cup Finals. Um, so this year it is back to well normal, or at least as normal as possible. Now the Colorado Avalanche have been the NHL's best team uh, over the course of the season. Now that might not be in terms of record, as we're going to see in just a minute. But this has been uh, one of the most consistent teams and the team that has been the, uh, I guess you could say, most entertaining uh, throughout the season. And a lot of people are backing the Avalanche now. Uh, through my research, I have seen that a lot of um, tipsters, experts are backing the Carolina Hurricanes to be one of those value bets. Uh, in the postseason as we go into it. So that might be a team that you want to take a little bit closer look at and to uh, possibly put your money behind. And of course, um, as a fan of a Canadian hockey team, the Edmonton Oilers, um, I have always second thoughts about betting on a Canadian team to win the Stanley Cup playoffs. Uh, it has been a long drought for Canadian teams winning the Stanley Cup playoffs. So you may like that Calgary Flames team to lift the cup. Uh, they are red hot right now, uh, but knowing that it's been so long since Canadian teams have won the Stanley Cup, you may want to back off that bet. 
All right, let's take a look at the NHL standings right now uh, with two nights left to play in the NHL season. All right, so I'm simply looking at the NHL's website right here. And as you can see here, we've got our six teams coming from the uh, two divisions in the Eastern Conference, Carolina, New York Rangers, uh, Pittsburgh, Florida, Toronto, and Tampa Bay. Then we've got Boston and Washington making up those wild card places. And like I said, we've got two games to play for some of these teams as we go into the playoffs next week. And I'm just gonna scroll down here to the West because they were this was solidified last night. Uh, why I've also waited till the end of the week to bring you this video. Uh, Colorado, um, the top team there in the Western Conference. And from the Central Division, we've got Colorado, Minnesota, and St. Louis. And then Calgary, Edmonton, and Los Angeles making up the Pacific Division. And then Dallas, who were uh, losers in overtime last night on Wednesday night. They've qualified for the playoffs through the wild card, and Nashville has qualified already. And uh, if you're like me and you you follow the NHL uh, quite closely, you would have gotten or seen a lot of memes uh, this morning on social media about uh, hockey fans being excited that the Vegas Golden Knights have failed to make the Stanley Cup playoffs. All right, now, before we finish up today, let's take a look at what the current NHL playoff matchups will be. Of course, with some of these teams having a few games left to play, as you can see there in the West, um, a few of these teams have two games still to play uh, and jockeying for positions still in the playoffs or for their playoff matchup. Uh, let's take a look at what the current matchups will look like as of today. April the 28th. Okay, so I've simply just brought up ESPN's matchups for the NHL right here. Uh, a great source and uh, one that you will, you know, if you're a sports better than one that you should access because this has got some great information. Uh, this can help you with your research when you're preparing to make your bets and uh, something that you can use hand in hand with Z Code system. All right, so as we got the Eastern Conference here, we've got a matchup with Florida taking on Washington. And, and as you can see there, we've got uh, Florida winning three times this year uh, against uh, the Capitals. Uh, Toronto currently taking on the Tampa Bay Lightning, Carolina and Boston uh, as we go into the playoffs. And we've got the New York Rangers and the Pittsburgh Penguins. Now, again, with two days to go in the season, we could have maybe one of these series change um, uh, with the playoffs. Uh, dropping the puck on Monday night. In the Western Conference right now, we've got Calgary taking on Dallas, Edmonton, and the Los Angeles Kings. That should be a really good matchup. Two teams who uh, come out of the uh, was it the Pacific uh, will be playing there. And then we've got Colorado taking on Nashville, the number one seed Colorado Avalanche. And then we've got the Minnesota Wild and the St. Louis Blues mixing it up there in the final matchup. And uh, that should be a, another good matchup. Game. Now, keep in mind, as I come to you right now on April the 20th, the President's Trophy has not been handed out to uh, the team with the best record in the NHL. And as you can see here, back on the NHL's website, Florida currently lead the President's Trophy chase by two points over the Colorado Avalanche, both teams with two games left to play. Now, this could go down to the last day of the season on Friday night. Uh, with the team, one of these two teams picking up the President's Trophy. Now, it's always good to remember that just because a team wins the President's Trophy, it does not mean they are going to win the Stanley Cup playoffs. The Stanley Cup playoffs are a um, a very difficult uh, tournament, if you will, uh, to navigate. And it is a uh, one in which we often see the President's Trophy winner from the regular season not go on to win the Stanley Cup. So that is one thing to keep in mind, uh, depending on which one of these two teams lifts that trophy at the end of the regular season. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me today here, talking to you about the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs, which dropped the puck on Monday night, May 2nd. Guys, go over to Z Code System right now, sign up today so you can get the latest tools to help you make great, smart, intelligent wagers on the NHL playoffs. All right, guys. Uh, please, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe to the channel. Stay up to date on everything we do here at Z Code System. And comment below. Let me know who you think is going to win the Stanley Cup playoffs this year. And I will see you next time here on Z Code System.